Tömegével érkeznek Magyarországra és Ukrajnából a háborús menekültek. A héten a számuk már meghaladta a 200 ezret. Nagy részük Budapesten keresztül tovább utazik harmadik országba, főleg Nyugat-Európába, de sokan mennek Lengyelországba is. A klubrádió stábja március 8-án kedden járt a keleti pályaudvaron, ahova folyamatosan naponta több ezren érkeznek, nem csak a magyar-ukrán, hanem a magyar-román határ felől is. Menekültekkel és segítőikkel beszélgettünk. Actually, we are going to Germany, so we have arrived from Ukraine. We live in the south east of Ukraine. We want to find a better life, probably in Europe. We come. We would like to come to our friends in Germany. So our destination for for now is Germany. We would like to go to Frankfurt, and then probably go to small town where our friends live. We want to have a shelter. For a particular time, when the war is taking place in Ukraine, so after the war finished, we would like to come back to Ukraine, hopefully. But uh, we're not sure if that will happen. Our fathers have left in Ukraine because they are not allowed to leave our country. Uh, people, oh, men from uh, aged uh, 18 to 60, they are not allowed to leave the country. So our uh, there are two families: our family and our friends' family. And so our fathers have left in our country. They will probably go and fight for our rules and for our independence of Ukraine. So we don't have any friends here, unfortunately. And that's why there is no opportunity for us to live here in any flat or something like that, because we don't have too much money. And that's why we have to find cheaper solutions how to escape from the war. Uh, when we went to your uh, west uh, station, railway station, um, the volunteers, there were a lot of volunteers and they uh, gave us enough food, we ate, very good, thank you so much mm -hmm. for your um, help and um, that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. And in addition to this, yeah, they um, help us with, with, with all the necessary information, so they said that we have to go uh, here to this station, because uh, it's not allowed to go to Germany from that station, so they gave enough um, information and opportunities for us. Thank you so much for that. Probably we would like to go to Germany right now, so we hope that so we can buy tickets for at 4 p.m. or something like that, and then we can sleep uh, in train just so we won't need any shelter today. In my town, everything is quite okay if we compare it to the whole country. So only nearby areas near my town were bombed a little bit. Across my town, across the river, there is another town uh, where the biggest ato atomic electro station is situated uh, in Europe, I mean. And probably you have heard something about that, that Russian troops have already went there and they are um, just sitting uh, in nearby the, this town. So this town is occupied by Russian troops and that's why the Europe may experience huge troubles uh, if something will happen on this atomic station.